Hello everybody, friends. I uh, wanted to wish you a Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays here from HBG. I'm Doug Friend, owner of Historical Board Gaming. Um, I just wanted to reach out and just extend our many, many thanks over this last past year of 2022, our ability to serve you. We hope that we've been um, you know, we've met your expectations and if I know, you know, we've had our shortcomings and we plan to do better. We always try to do better, come out with, you know, products for you guys and the ability to, you know, do more, but uh, there's always room to grow and uh, we hope that uh, you stay with us and uh, see what's uh, in store. Well, it's been cold. I know a lot of, uh, I heard the front coming, cold front coming in this morning and, uh, Man, it was windy and it dropped 40 degrees just like that, it seemed like. So uh, I got a picture here of our little our little uh, babies. She's only a year old. <laughs> she just got uh, a little, little hoodie on to stay warm. So uh, she's only like six pounds, right, oh, almost seven. So uh, we have two uh, and uh, One's a two-year-old, and one's one, so they keep us busy. You know, when uh, you know, I turned sixty this year, as many as you know, and uh, <laughs> you kind of sit back and start reflecting. You go, sixty, okay. There's fewer years ahead of me than there are behind me. So, but you know, it's 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 good. Um, hopefully, I'm I'm wiser and more knowledgeable, and uh, you know, keep a better head on my shoulders. I've got my three kids coming for the holidays. I know many of you got friends and family coming in, uh, doing a lot of uh, neat things. And, you know, I, I don't take it lightly. You know, I show uh, the manger with the baby Jesus in the background. I am a believer myself. I always try to be honest uh, for everyone, uh, to everyone. Uh, I try to keep um, everyone in my prayers. I want to do good. Uh, always do good um, in this world there's so you know it's a broken world and uh, there's so many things you can look down on we've had you know many losses this year in the in the family of ours my wife and I you know she lost her father and it was tough you know I was in his I was in the room when he when he passed and uh, we, we were actually there for the day and uh, as he declined you know I I, I did get to let him know that uh, I would take care of his daughter and, uh, you know, not to worry about it. And uh, it was tough. Never, <clears throat> never really experienced, you know, something like that. So he was a good man, good man. And I uh, know my wife misses him daily. So, and uh, my father is probably getting ready to pass pretty soon. He has a cancer and uh, it's kind of overtaken his body. So it's a matter of time. But, you know, as we get older, we, you know, we learn to live with, you know, as the older uh, people, you know, move on and the newer ones take on with kids and grandkids. And uh, it's it's a world that we just got to keep pushing, pushing ahead. So don't, don't leave this to be a downer. But, uh, you know, have a good holiday and, uh, you know, do reflect on life. Uh, my wife and I got to watch a really neat uh, uh, Christmas show. We watched some of these old black and whites, and there's one called, um, it happened on Fifth Avenue, and it's a really good movie, And if, if you like that kind of stuff. I know, of course, there's the old Elf and Christmas Vacation, and, you know, all the funny ones. Um, I, I even like Nightmare Before Christmas. I just like the music, and it's really neat the way they did that. Uh, stop motion photography is really cool. It's kind of neat little story. So uh, anyway, uh, hope everyone has a happy holiday, Merry Christmas. Um, and again, uh, these are some tough times, and I know people are at different stages in their lives, different things going on. You know, uh, some of the things that we experienced this last year uh, were some of the things. Uh, I never wanted to experience in my life uh, with some of my family and uh, I know some of you guys are probably going through even worse things so 
you know, I, like I, I threw a newsletter out there and let people know if there's anything that you need, uh, you know, not just from historical board gaming from, but if you need to talk to someone as a, a friend or someone just to they'll listen to you, I'm here, uh, I'll be around. My phone number is 918-691-6222. I'm at Central Time on Tulsa, Oklahoma. And uh, you're welcome to call. My kids are coming actually two days after Christmas. That's when they can get together. My son is in Texas. He's on border uh, call. Well, he could be called up. He's in the Air Force there, stationed at Fort Worth. So he can't come up. So my other two kids, we're all gonna get together, I think Tuesday night. We've already got together with my wife's side. So uh, we're gonna have a pretty quiet Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. Christmas Eve, we're actually going to church with my, uh, my mother-in-law and, and uh, so we'll spend some time with her. But Christmas Day morning, we, we probably get to sleep in. <laughs> yeah, maybe uh, the puppies will get to open a present or something. So uh, my wife and I are just gonna chill and uh, appreciate each other. My wife and I do get to uh, celebrate our anniversary, New Year's Eve, and uh, it'll be a lot of good, a lot of fun. So you guys have a Merry Christmas, Happy New Year, and I'll see you in 2023, and I'm sure I'll have another video. But like, like I said before, um, you know, don't hesitate to call, uh, reach out, there's something you need to talk about. Uh, I've been around, for, I've been around 60 years. I've seen a lot of things and uh, you know, I'll be more and more happy to talk to you and uh, even pray with you. Thank you, Merry Christmas.